All right. I have. I, am I really starting with this one? I, I kind of have to. We're going to start with Caveman Olympics. I guess. Streamer's choice? Uh, this, this is streamer's choice, yeah. I had to get one ready. Or maybe, uh, maybe we'll do... Alright, what do you guys think? Caveman Olympics, Museum Madness, or Pizza Tycoon? Pizza, 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 pizza. All right, all right, all right. We'll do Pizza Tycoon. Let's get it going. I have to turn it down a little. It's going to be loud as heck. Here we go. I knew it. I just saved you guys so fast. You have no idea. Do you understand how this is at 30% volume? If this was at 100%, some I, somebody would have been hurt. I'm so happy I caught that when I did. Okay. All right, so let's get it open here. This is, uh... Here we go. This is... that off. Pizza shop, whatever this is. Pizza tycoon. Main test. What, what does special animation mean? This is very bright. Okay, how do I just go? Oh. Old game, new game. I've never played this before. I guess new game. Mission mode, free mode, let's do mission mode. Select mission. Entry, rise, fall, gangster. Tricky, traveler, winner, short. Gangster. Um, let's just figure, let's just do entry. Entry. 1394, arrival in Berlin, takes out the first loan, opens first restaurant, first to own pizza. Able to meet 100% of deliveries for one week. I don't understand what this is. First own pizza. Uh, what is rise? Arrival in Paris. You then are a worker. You get first prize in pizza competition. A thousand pizzas sold in a single day. That seems like it's not possible. $10,000 turnover in one day. A thousand pizzas in a day? I'm not even sure McDonald's sells a thousand Big Macs in a day across the whole entire world. Do they? Arrival in Baltimore. Open first restaurant. First own pizza. Thousand kilograms of ingredients used in a day. That's so much. And then win 10 grand. What is a gangster? Okay, you arrive in London, make first contact with Mafia. Tricky. First raid on competitor has assets of $500,000. What, I'm stealing from a competitor? We're just going to do entry. Here we go. Select level. Pushover, easy, normal, or... We're going to do just normal. <laughs> Jonathan Japes has $8,000, age 41, popularity 45. Is that 100? 
45 intelligence, 30 charisma, 18 courage. Dennis Flatulenso. Ugh. It's got a terrible personality, though. No, terrible cooking. Got a great personality. And this is the name of the restaurant? Pizza Land. Wait, what? What's going on? There. Uh, no, no, no. What? Really? There's a Donald Trump in this game? There's a Muppet Beaker Trump. <laughs> me, 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 me. Believe me. <laughs> Sorry, I had to get away from that one. That was okay. Uh, Pizza Land, whatever. That's fine. Pizza Land. Charisma, intelligence, eighty-five. Energy, thirty-eight. Health, forty. Well, it's Alfredo, Ronnie, Rhonda, Elvis is an Elvis. Okay, these are... <sighs> Wait, what was this? This guy. I like this guy. Sure. But he sucks at everything. I'm just gonna go. <laughs> well, what a fucked up world we live in. In whatever this, what time frame this is. New York, Baltimore, Chicago. Chicago's not all the way up here. That's like Canada. Madrid? Vienna. Let's just go to, uh, let's just go to, um, let's go to Italy. Let's go to, let's go to Rome. Market leader, nobody. Nobody's ever made a pizza before in this room. Sounds good. Wait, what? Nobody. What time? Is this back in like the caveman times? Nobody's made a pizza yet? Oh. Pizza you eat. Range, location, pro. Districts, what am I looking at? <laughs> That's clearly, this is just a, a worse, this is like a pegboard version of this one. Um, map character. Mission mode one. Dennis Flatulenza, that's not me. Start of the day, 9 o'clock. Wait, start of the day, 5? 4 a.m. Start of the day, score. Position. Loser, failure, okay. Turn page. Look at the... I'll go, I gotta go to Berlin? Take it alone? Okay, how do I make a pizza? Locations. Uh, the church, the bank, the cinema, the disco. Why would I have a pizza restaurant in a church? What's this? <laughs> Why am I like Google Earthing? Road, what? Hotel gyms? Where's my restaurant? <laughs> we messed up. Please, next. <laughs> Wait, I can end my turn.
the bank. Uh, yeah, this is very complicated. I'm not exactly sure what I'm supposed to be doing here in Pizza Tycoon Terminal. What? I don't have any time to waste with little people like you. Goodbye. That's the BF Bugleberry mask. Agree. NYPD? Who are you? Get out of here at once. Why is the NYPD in an old-timey western sheriff's uniform? And <laughs> what? I don't understand. I think I just wanted to call people. Let's call Wall Street Finance. Wall Street Finance may help you. Agree. I need a loan. I want to invest some money. I want to transfer. I want to repay. I want to. I want to. I want. I want to invest some money. I want a loan. We can offer you the following loan arrangement: three thousand dollars interest, twenty-three percent, twelve months. What? A twenty-three percent interest? Okay. I want to transfer some money. Transfer $8,600 to account number. I need account numbers? Is that mine? Okay. Um, B Mart. B Mart, how may I help you? What? Why do they all have so much money behind them? Okay, other. Reservoir frogs? Holy shit! Hey, you lousy little pizza maker, where's the fire? Um, looking for a job on the side. Pick up a suitcase full of pirated films in the Hotel Tower in Union City on March 4th at 10.30 and bring it to the Hotel Low Society in Manhattan on March 5th. Um, okay. If you're successful, you'll get $1,638. The risk is 9% interest. Do you accept the mission? Sure. We expect you to carry out the orders to the letter and with absolute discretion. Okay. Um... <laughs> just going around. I'm just like, welcome to our little joke shop. We have we have something for everybody. Do you have ice cream? We just imported some delicious ice cream. What's your favorite? Lemon. One scoop is eleven thousand dollars. Okay. How many scoops do you want? Um, twenty. Okay. Well, I can't afford ice cream. Hey there, you lousy pizza maker. Uh, I'm looking for a job. You've already got one. I need money now. Before you can hit the big time, we need to get to know you better. You have some. You have to make a name for yourself. All right, what I have to do? All right, hey, I got a NYPD. I got something for you. Who are you? Get out. Of Never mind. Okay, I have to deliver the. I don't even remember the street. Uh, I'm, I just, I'm done. This one's done. We're going to go with uh, another one called Museum Madness. This one looks very interesting. I can turn this up a little bit, I think. Science and History Learning Mystery. Museum Madness. Wait, let me... I can bring it up a little bit. Okay, that's fine. Just want to turn it up a little. This is 
is my room. It's very decent. The National Museum database usually has tons of great stuff. That dinosaur puzzle I downloaded last month was excellent, but there isn't anything new since then. I think I'll quit info surfing and sign off for tonight. I sure miss talking to Mick, the museum information computer kiosk. That robot knows everything about the museum. Too bad he's offline. Until the museum computers are fixed. Interactive System Service National Museum, please wait. <laughs> now this would terrify me as a, 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 an eight-year-old. Oh cool, it's Mick! I thought you were offline while the museum was being converted to total computer control. I guess you missed me too much since I'm the only one who knows you can think for yourself. Ever since I discovered you could talk back to me last year, you've given me the best information about the museum. Uh... I was offline undergoing reprogramming, but I have returned because I need your help. The entire National Museum is in danger. You must help me save it before its secrets are lost forever. You know I am responsible for maintaining the museum database. The database has been corrupted and the museum exhibits are out of control. And only this eight-year-old boy can do it, and not the police or the FBI or, like, CIA or anything. You. This is some sort of new online game, right? Uh, how can the museum be in danger? I know you're the guardian of the museum's database, but this is a little extreme, don't you think? This is no game. A strange force has taken over the museum since it closed a month ago to undergo conversion to total computer control. The exhibits have come to life, and they're acting very peculiar. I suspect that a virus has invaded the system and corrupted the main control program. You must come to the museum at once and help me track down the virus. Don't go. This is very weird, Nick. How can I help? I know you're the one in charge of keeping the museum database in shape, but you keep saying that so strangely. And I know you always tell the truth, but what can I do? <sighs> you must come to the museum at once. My power is failing and my memory has been corrupted. I cannot last much longer. I don't know about this. <laughs> but Mick has been programmed to always act in the best interest of the museum. He's always given me good information and helped me solve problems using my the museum database, yeah. If he says I'm the only one who can help, then I guess I have to believe him. Besides, he's a good friend and he needs my help. Oh my god. I will download a program onto your floppy drive. Bring the disk with you. It contains vital information. You will know how to use it when you get inside. I must sign off now. I think I hear the dinosaurs roaring. Or is that the Wright Brothers plane? Hurry! I cannot last much longer! Adam Sandler made a movie about this like 10 years ago already. I mean, no, uh, Ben, uh, not Ben Stiller. Robots, dinosaurs, the Wright Brothers? I guess I have to do something. I know I can trust Mick because he is programmed to always tell the truth. I, I, what about you? You sound pretty programmed too. To say the same like five words. I better get down to the museum and check this out. That was just to get to the title card. Hey guys, is Mick programmed to always tell the truth? I'm not sure. I thought maybe possible. They always did the pre-credits thing back here. Is this Pokemon? That's the same outfit. Okay, I'm here. I'm glad I waited until morning. This place could be very creepy at night. <laughs> it's the same image. It's the same image, but they just put a hat on him and put like a t-shirt here with like a backpack. Oh, wait, 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 I'm gonna get grounded now. How do I get inside? Mick wasn't much help. I guess I'll have to figure it out for myself. Uh, you made it up the stairs. Good for you. I wonder if anyone's around. Maybe I should take a closer look. 
I know the museum is closed for repairs. Maybe someone left a door open or something. What happened? Am I blacking out? Uh, welcome to National Museum <laughs> Hours. Monday to Saturday, 10 to 6. Sunday, 12 to 4. The museum is closed for repairs. Authorized personnel may enter through the side door. Hmm. Huh, hmm. I can't read this. Hard. Harney's an electric supply. If it's electric, we can fix it. Dear Hari, I had to have it early. If you need to get and Ingerd aged the combination lock on the guide door. You know the combination, but if you forgot, just look it up. Once you are inside, follow the game radar to the entrance hall. See you tomorrow. Great. Um, if you forget, just look up. Once you are inside, follow the same order to the... Uh, I don't know what this says. Oh, no, okay, if I go all the way... If I have to go all the way back here. I can read this. Here, pull back in your chair and go all the way back. I had to leave early. If you need to get inside, use the combination lock on the side door. You know the combination, but if you forget, just look up. Once you are inside, follow the same order to the entrance hall. See you tomorrow. The game order. Whatever. Alright, let's go. Smash the fucking window. Alright, side door. Let's see what it is this way. I feel like this is not possible to screw this up. This place is spooky. I hope I don't bump into anything. All right, look up. Uh, well, I have like, what the hell was that? Do I have like weapons? Who gave this kid a knife? Um, pen, handkerchief. No, I want to like look up. If you forget it, just look up. Oh. <laughs> what kind of password is this? I know I've seen these symbols somewhere before. Maybe I should look around outside to jog my memory. Why would you need to shine the flashlight on this? Uh, was it outside? I had to look up. I can't look up. <laughs> this is the password to the door. <laughs> this is the equivalent of me, like, pasting my stream key on my house. Okay, uh, American flag, globe. Alright, America, globe, tree, ship, computer. American flag, all of the world. Flag, world, tree, ship, computer. Flag, world, tree, ship, computer. Flag, world, tree, ship, computer. Got it. Okay. Same thing, get the light out. Flag world, tree ship, computer. Flag world, tree ship, computer. There we go. Uh, what is that? What did I just pick up? Card to room one. Am I in the museum? What is the kind of museum is this? What the hell is this? Uh, that this is room three. <laughs> I 
I don't know what room this is. Exit to museum. No, no, I need to go to room one. Three. What? <laughs> two. This is room two to room four. No, I need room one. Exit. Wouldn't room one be like right here? No, that's room three. Which room is this? Workshop. It's locked. Which. <laughs> Found it. Read run room one. Nice. Is the door locked? What on earth is all this stuff? I'm gonna have to remember this. All right, it's another one of these stupid things. Um, all right, flag statue. Uh, is it supposed to be like one, two, three, four, five? Flag statue, mountain, train, witch. Flag statue, mountain train witch. Flag statue, mountain train witch. All right, let's find two. Flag. Um. F uh, flag. Mount something a mountain train witch. Flag statue, mountain train witch. Did I do it? Did I move? I, there was a, it was two and four. Where's what the fuck is happening? All right, I got it. What was it? Um, flag statue, mountain train witch. Uh, flag, flag, statue, mountain, train, witch. Flag, statue, mountain, train, witch. Factory, factory, pyramid, hammer, shield, book. Factory, pyramid, hammer, shield, book. Um, flag, statue, mountain, train, witch. Factory, pyramid, hammer, Shield. Some just screenshot this. Just somebody got one. What's this next key for? Three. I think somebody made this just to fuck with this kid. You know what I mean? This is the wall. These walls are cardboard. This is not even a real place. Is this one is this three got it let's hope it's not boxes with symbols it is seahorse let's just screenshot it ready take it good somebody get it good now I gotta go find four again There's five. There's a five? I didn't even come. Oh, hold it. Wait, wait, wait. Five is. 
Across from two. This is two. But this is one? Five is across from one. What do I have? Four. That's three. No, the boxes one was two. <laughs> I mean one. Here comes five. Five is across from three. Just make a map. Do you think I have like paper and like crayons in front of me? I'm at my desk. Screenshot this. All right, five was across from three. Down here. This is the workshop. Ah, all right, all right, turn around. It's directly in front of me. No, it's not. It's not directly in front of me because that's the workshop. Wait, stop, stop, stop. All right, I think that's it. I need to find, no, I think it's over here. I have no idea where I'm going. That's where five is supposed to be. This is, this is like the Redler is behind this. I told you, they just fuck with me. It's across from there. not it that's the exit <laughs> shit okay does anybody have any idea from here where to get how to get to five I think I've tried every option that's this le there is no five it has to be this is two and four Okay, that's two and four. There, uh, but I don't, I don't even know what direction I'm turning. Um, over here. <laughs> I need Mick. <laughs> Mick, help. Help me, Mick. It's not that one. It's not the one when I turn around. That's the exit, but I'm not even facing the right way. Like you understand, like this is this is all fucked up. That's not it. This is the exit. This okay over here is two and four. This is a circle. All right, hold on a minute. No, stop. Don't take. Don't comb your hair. Wasn't it right here? There's another... I don't even think there's another door. What's this other door? Hard to the museum door. Got it. Let's go. Let's go. I'm get fucking excited. I, I am pumped right now.
Oh, there he is! This must be the main hall of the museum. It looks more like the inside of a tomb at night. I wonder if this place is haunted. Oh, there's Mick! I wonder why he doesn't say something to me. He said I'd know what to do when I got here. I guess I'm still on my own. I O error. What do you mean, I O error? You got me all the way down here to tell me you have an I O error? Take two aspirin and get over it. I thought you needed my help. Aggr passive, aggressive. No, that's just straight up aggressive. What, wait, what do you say? Maybe he's trying to tell me something. That's the message I get from my computer when I haven't put the disk in the drive. What kept you? I've been waiting for you to arrive. My power is fading fast. You must act quickly. I need a new bat. Well, why didn't you tell me to come in through the skylight instead of through the maze? Keep your silicone shirt on. You didn't give me much help. Hey, what's going on? You need bats? I need new bat. You need a bat? What? Batter up? Bats in your belfry? Batman? I guess I should look for something batty. This better be worth it. I'm missing the next episode of America's Most Unwanted. Hey, well, let's be fair. This this kid is like 10. Museum tour on tape. Batteries include. Alright, well, let's open it up. The kid's pretty handy. Alright, his batteries. He <laughs> just jabbed it with the knife. Only one of them had batteries? Yeah. Yeah, take some soda. Ah, oh, that's better. I was almost a victim of an energy crisis. We have to work quickly to save the museum before my power runs low again. Please insert the disk again so that I may reprocess the data I sent you. I'm working on it! Why did he get so mean? I have reprocessed the information on the disk. The virus caused large gaps in my memory chips, but I was able to reconstruct some of the missing data from the program I modemmed to you. I have modified the disk and put a new label on it. You can use the disk to save a record of your progress through the museum. Until all of the gaps are filled in, we cannot discover the source of the virus that has infected the museum computers. The virus has thrown the exhibits into chaos. We must go to each exhibit and restore it to its normal state. I'm not sure anything is ever normal around here, but that sounds like fun. How do we get started? First, there are a few things you should know. The exhibits are now fully automated. Read the holographic information displays that appear as you enter each exhibit. You can access more information by activating the holo displays in each exhibit room. They are on the left. Cool. That way I'll know what's going on, I think. Be careful, all exhibit computer systems have been corrupted, including the cybernetic replicas. The Cyreps are robots that look like people from history. You must interact with them to fix the exhibits. And then I have to talk to the robots that look like people from history books. Yes, that is what was just said. Excellent. Will you be there to help me? I will accompany you to each exhibit. When we arrive, I will link myself to the main computer and try to calculate what must be done to restore the exhibit. I will provide you with data for each room, but my processing power is limited and I don't need batteries and there are gaps in the database due to the effects of the virus and the thing that you put in. Okay, got it. We go to each exhibit, I check out the information displays, then I check with you to see what's happening after that. I talk to any side reps that are hanging out, and then I fix what's wrong with the exhibit. If I get stuck, you can give me some help, unless that part of your brain has been fried. No sweat, let's get started. How do I get to the first exhibit? Oh, here's the map on the wall to unlock the exhibits. When we arrive, consult me again to learn what you must do. Remember, you must restore all the exhibits before we can find the source of the virus. Oh my god, let's go. I actually don't remember where to go. <laughs> I 
What is this? No! This is a mess. It looks more like spaghetti than a map. How do you see spaghetti here? I think this kid needs a coffee. The map has been scrambled by the same force that is affecting the museum. You must unscramble it before we can unlock the exhibits, but we're going to be here for a while. Try touching one square and then another to rearrange them until the map is fixed. I'm going to shut down for a while to save my energy. You do it. Alright, we got a... Uh, got, um... I just yawned. Fuck. Um... I need to think it connects to this. On the other side here. I need the I need the left side here. Where's the left side? Alright, I got that. That's good. Got this one over here. Alright, then that goes up. More of these like clouds, whatever they are. No, where is it? Right there. That leads up to the green area, which is this one, and then that leads up to here. Huh, now that's a good question. I'll ask it again. I didn't ask a question. There we go. Alright, this one comes over here. Let's get the middle correct. Everybody's resident sleeper right now. <laughs> we gotta give this one a chance. We do. I'm sorry, we have to give this one a chance. Where is the... Where the hell does this one go? Is it like a cap? No. No, shit! There it is. Okay, then we bring this one over here. It's wrong. Wrong. Correct. Okay, we need the... This one definitely goes over here. No, it doesn't. No, that one doesn't either. Uh, something went wrong here. <laughs> This all goes up. The whole middle <laughs> is fucked up. Wait. Hold on. Give me a moment. I just simply have to go like this. Okay. But this is... How is this wrong? I need this one down here. No. Where is it? It's, it's like right here. There it is. I'm fixing it. Don't worry. I got it. Okay. All right. I'm I'm going. I'm going. All right. Now there's this one over here. This one over here. That one over here. Bingo. Glad to see you finally finished the map. Now we can proceed to the exhibits. What do you mean finally? Something tells me I'm going to be doing all the work. We have no time for this idle chatter. I have analyzed the present state of the museum exhibits. We can proceed to any exhibit. They're all desperately in need of help. We should move quickly before and my power runs out. Don't tempt me to slow down. What do we do now? Yes, under the map will unlock the exhibits. Just touch a location on the map to unlock that exhibit hall. I will fill you in on the situation when we get there. I mean, we have to go to the dinosaur one. There's a lot. A hall of robots, computer tech, radio, energy, simple machines, boring. How big is the universe? Kind of good. Solar system, cool. Rockets and computers, all right. Air-powered flight, the Wright Brothers, cool. 
Salem Witch Trials, Ellis Island, nah. Hall of the Dinosaurs, I don't even see any others. Dinosaurs were first discovered in the 1820s. <laughs> In my brain, it was like, they're like birds. We like found them. They're still around. Since then, their remains have been found on every continent. They were the largest creatures to ever live on land, and they dominated the earth for 150 million years. This is some computer lab. I don't know what they do here, but it sure looks important. Maybe it's some type of government work. Where are the dinosaurs? <sighs> 150 years, many scientists uh, you excavate dinosaurs as fossils, you can make them into models. Um, yeah, you can, uh, there's a computer program that assembles the bones completely. Uh, the dinosaur reconstruction computer assembles a dinosaur within a few minutes. This computer is on display here. Okay, you, made, you can make a dinosaur in a few minutes. The program that builds a dinosaur had this dinosaur reconstruction program has been wrecked by the museum-wide computer virus. Say, okay, go fix it. The dinosaur skeletons it built are completely corrupted. You must rebuild the skeletons. You got it. This is a dinosaur bone assembly program. Why not try the controls and take this thing for a spin? This is a tri supposed to be a triceratops. Okay, this is just auto. All right, Triceratops. That one. Wait, no, why is this changing? What's going on? Why is it changing? I thought it wanted me to make a uh, Triceratops. Okay, I got, I got it. There it is. What's wrong with the tail? That's it, right? Different neck? <laughs> not a triceratops. <laughs> it's the legs. That's in, but they're also wrong. The legs aren't even touching the ground. It's the front legs. That's not correct. But they didn't have big tip. Wait, hold on. That looks close. Oh, fuck. Okay, we'll, we'll make the T Rex. T-Rex head, there's T-Rex neck, body. It's that one. He has the little baby hands.
<laughs> this is making me laugh way too much. Okay. <laughs> Help! T-Rex. So just the tail. That doesn't fit. This is correct. And the legs, I think? Is that it? That looks... I mean, I, I know, I know, what does the T-Rex's tail look like? Doesn't look like that. It's kind of long, isn't it? I think it's this one. I think it's that one. Oh god damn it. Doing like the prayer hands. It doesn't look like anything go there it is. That's not the T-Rex? That's not the T that's not the T-Rex. I'm surprised. No, that was the, this is a T-Rex head. The tail. His head is too small. I got it. Oh, that's a fucking big fatty. <laughs> that's, a, that's not, that is not what a T-Rex looks like. Uh, bullshit. This is Slimer from Ghostbusters. That is not a T-Rex. That is a frog. Bull, I, I, that is absolute dog shit. I refuse to accept that one. I don't even know what that looks like. Stegosaurus, I can do this one. Fucking T-Rex, give me a break. <laughs> what is going on here? A new dinosaur. Uh, Frank, you think you put it together wrong? No, I didn't. It's like it's all this one. Tail, the tail is correct too. Got it. That <laughs> Why is it skin? Why is it flesh? This is not it was scales, wasn't it? Well, this wasn't part of his body. <laughs> Weren't these different like armor plates? These were not just pieces of skin with fat in them, like a camel. Iguanodon, I don't even know what that is. Triceratops, you're going for it again. What the fuck does a triceratops even look like? I mean, that. Th when I think of triceratops, this is what I see in my head. Like that, uh, that just big, thick body. The 
short. They're not tall. It is like this, but is the body bigger? No. They're not that short? The body is right. No, I, I know that's what I'm saying. This looks correct. It's the neck. Taller and thicker. No, the neck, that's correct. The legs need to be longer. No, this is a, this is a cat. That's not a triceratops. It's definitely that one. You have both legs wrong. There's no way. <laughs> it's a dachshund. No, the body is, it's not the body. Look, the body just gives you the starting point. That's, this is the Triceratops body. Don't they have a low hanging neck? <laughs> this is a goddamn Tri, this is it. It's, no, it's not these ones. I gotta look up what I gotta see what a triceratops looks like. I need to look it up right now. The neck needs to be longer. No, it doesn't. Triceratops. What the fuck does a triceratops look like? Like this. I had it right. This is correct. The head needs to be up a little higher. Like right there. And then they had these these fat asses, these legs, and then the tail is not that long. The Triceratops tail is not this long. Legs are two. There's only like three legs. Look at this. It's. <sighs> this is not it. There's not. It's not it. It's absolutely not these ones. It's not the neck. The neck is in the right spot. No, this is wrong. That's not a Triceratops' body. A Triceratops' body doesn't go up this high. wrong. Yeah, everyone was screaming at me. You guys didn't even get it right either. Uh, I, uh, break Brachiosaurus? I don't, I don't know what that, I know Brontosaurus. Is it, it's the same thing. Okay. That's definitely correct. The hind legs, uh, I think they're, they're like this, aren't they? Yeah, they're big, tall, they got kind of those, the, the big legs with the tail. Uh, 
How big are their arms? Aren't they like usually that long? They have the big tails, right? So what's missing here? The legs, maybe? Like that, maybe? No? Longer neck. Hey, yeah, the head doesn't look right. No, the head is not correct. That's definitely not the right head. You're right. It's just one of these like weird ones. It's like the weird crocodile one. No, it is that one. Okay. So let's go back to this. All right. So now, what is what is wrong here? The neck. I think the neck is not right. Long legs. I'm not sure it's this neck. You guys are telling me it's this. I don't think it is. This looks pretty right. That, okay, that to me looks correct. There's only three options. Are they squished in together? They're not that long. No, it's definitely that one. It has to be, right? The body? If I change the body, it's not going to be uh, Brontosaurus anymore. Change neck, change neck. That doesn't look right. <laughs> you already tried that tail. Wrong forelimb. It's not the prayer hands. Is it the prayer hands? They walked on all fours. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's, it's got to be like these two. It's either this one or this one. Is it the shorter ones or the the bigger, the longer ones? So this is it. Neck and tail are wrong. Well, fight the 3,000 people that are screaming as loud as they can that I have the neck correct. Shorter tail. <laughs> now the neck. I'm not. Is it? I, oh my god. I'm just. It was the fucking neck. I knew it. I knew it. I told you guys the neck was wrong. I told you the neck was wrong. And I was. Everybody yelled at me. They laughed at me. Said I was stupid. You're dumb. You're an idiot. The neck was fucking. I, I knew it. I was right. Everyone, <laughs> long neck, big neck, long neck. Somebody is overfeeding these things. Like, I don't, I, and then the image in my brain when I think of like a brontosaurus is not this. This looks like the Loch Ness monster picture that circled around. Like this is a person's arm. 
a hand, arm, and this is their shoulder, and their head should be here. This is their other arm. Okay, Iguanodon. Got that one easily. This next one. Didn't even need to look. <laughs> Alright, so this t this is the head down here for me. This is the tail. I feel like this is standing this way and its head is like slumped down, lying down, and sleeping. That's how they sleep. I did it. That was tough, but I'm glad I boned up on paleontology before I came down here. Wonder if the dinosaur exhibits are in any better shape. Maybe I should take a look. Now that's what I call a tyrant lizard. Is this thing alive? Stab it. Uh, Tyrannosaurus Rex. Don't care. <laughs> it's a pug neck. That Iguanodon looks a little like my math teacher. I wonder if he can do three plays multiplication in his little brain. Right. Didn't know the Brachiosaurus was so tall. I wonder what was kept in that bump on its head. This is one long dinosaur. I bet she would make a great water slide if you could get her to stand still. Those three horns look dangerous. I'll bet he could play fullback for any team he wanted. No, they don't do anything. The Stegosaurus was probably a nice guy, but I wouldn't want him to get mad and hit me with that spiked tail. This is fun, but I still have work to do if I'm going to get this whole museum put back together. These guys are dynamite, but I should hustle back to the main hall and see if anything else is falling apart. What was the point of me walking down here? <clears throat> Alright, that was fun. That was easy. Ocean life. All of animal habitats. All of ecology. The Earth's geology. Prehistoric people. The development of writing. Knights, heraldry, and jousting. Galileo's telescope or industrial revolution. Solar system. How big is the universe? The solar system. All right, everyone wants to do it. Sure. Nobody's gonna read any of this. Look at all the stars. I love looking at that night sky. It makes me think about how large the universe is and how small we are. Also, it makes me think about a t-shirt that I could possibly purchase if I really cared about having one of those from the, you do exclamation point t-shirts. The sky looks peaceful enough, but I'm sure something must be wrong, or we wouldn't be here. Warning! Computer analysis has determined that stars in projection dome do not match star atlas settings. Uh-oh, there's the main computer's voice. It probably means something bad's about to happen. Warning! Warning! Program overload cannot resolve out-of-place star data. System shutdown sequence initiated. Star data will be purged from system in 60 minutes. Guess that means I have to find a way to put those stars back where they belong. I always wanted to save the world, but saving the universe is a little much. Maybe you should check with Mick. He usually has some good info. What is this like, a, like an ion cannon? I don't understand. Is this like a death star? What do you mean purge the stars? 
This is the planetarium projection room. The celestial projector shows the stars as they actually appear in the night sky. Okay. The projector's program has been corrupted by the virus and the five stars are out of place. Oh, and only five are out of place. I was going to say, there's only five? When the projection system tried to correct it in locations of these stars, it caused a program overload. All the data will be lost forever if the stars are not put back in their proper location. Use the information in the star atlas to reprogram the projector and put the stars back where they belong. Looks like the sky in the planetarium, but something tells me that it's not quite the same. If I'm correct, I should be able to get some information about the stars from the screen. Maybe I can use the info to put the stars back where they belong. What? Spectrum. Blue, blue, green... Frog. Uh... Light green... Orange, pink, red. What does that tell me, though? I don't, I don't get it. 826, 1991. Okay, 826-1991. Ah, uh, new game. Forty two sixty. This is cool, though. I don't hate this. It's a fun game. I don't get what this stuff is for, though. Radio wave, infrared spectrum, like, uh, how do I... I mean, that's correct. Date and everything? Project. It's right there. your birthday in. It's time for you guys to pick where we go. This is where we were. I believe at the end of... No, I think we were further down. No, we were right here. Right like here. Uh, no, the bar. We did the Bard's Tale, right? Yeah, I remember the Bard's Tale. Pizza Tycoon's right there. Yeah, this looks right. All right. In just a moment, you'll be able to click on the screen. And please do. Right now. <laughs> Wayne's World. <laughs> Of wizardry, proving grounds of the mad. Uh, it seems to be unanimous Wayne's world. This is going to be just a side scroller where you have a slingshot and you have to, you're in like a living room and jumping over stuff and it's like a guitar power up that you pick up for points. I already know what this game is, but we're going to play it. Like every game back in like the 80s and 90s that was based on a TV show or a movie was always a side scroller. Let's see if, how, how that is. Capstone. 
Pinnacle of Entertainment Software. Remember this? Watch that be it. <laughs> Next disc. We're not mental or anything, so don't be afraid. They have whole My name voice? is Wayne, and this is Garth. That's it? That's all? They just do one line? Oh, it's just pulled audio. Ah, uh, uh, where you, the viewer, can express your opinions about babes. Oh, okay. Yeah! Or perhaps videos. Or even Garth's... Yeah, or whatever you want to talk about. Okay. Oh, first caller. Hi, my name is C. L. Elvis. I'm the local community access program yeah. reviewer. What do you think of our show? Well, that's why I called. First of all, I think that uh, the Wayne's World logo should rotate counterclockwise instead of clockwise. That would double our ratings. Not. Not. <laughs> also, since yeah, I think that uh, Garth should be left-handed, it will add a certain symmetry. Sorry, chump. No can do. Garth's not in his right mind. Are you mental? Get, Get the, the net. net. Finally, I think that those interruption things that happened during the show should be taken out. They distract the viewer. You mean the commercials? Do you know anything about television? How did you become a reviewer? I've gone in and out. I always wanted to be on TV. But when I dropped out of high school, I couldn't get any jobs except this one. Do you guys need a third person? We could be C.L. Wayne and Garth. Yeah, that monkey's my flat on my butt. Yo, dudes, I just saw the most amazing thing, a flashing red light in the sky, out by the radio station. I think it was a UFO. <laughs> yeah, well, oh, I forgot to tell you. This UFO flew right up next to my car, and I could see the little alien looking out of the window at me. What did they look like? They were uh, green, and they had four eyes. Well, the aliens on the ship that I saw uh, had eight eyes and antenna. And they glowed in the dark. Get the net! Oh, well, I just forgot to tell you. Uh, they beamed me onto their spaceship. Excellent. They took me to their leader. She was this awesome babe alien who looked like Madonna. Oh, oh she oh, sh 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 swing! Here it comes, ready? No. Good call, girl. Next caller. Can I do something? I think that you and your long-haired hippie friend are at the front of the decent, hard-working, normally upstanding citizens of this community. We're ashamed. We're not We're worthy. Not worthy. This is just the soundboard of the movie. You only bought this to hear these lines because there's no such thing as media that could play out of your computer. When you... Th th this was like, oh, I remember when he said that when I went to the movie theater because that's the only time I've ever been able to hear him say that. This was a huge deal. Victor says what? I, there's no, I can't skip. There's no such thing as skipping. Yeah, they were on the Saturday Night Live. But you had to wait till Saturday to hear him go, We're not worthy! She's a babe. God, I love this woman. Who are they even talking about? Cool. <laughs> Remember that time Garth's mom... What is going on? Why is this happening? Oh, way, way. Uh... <laughs> Why is this happening? I cannot go on. Next 
squeeze me? How do I do anything else? I, we need to see what happens. Why did I vote for this? This was not a streamer's choice. This was a chat's choice. Wing! Party on, girl. Party on, Wing. It's Wing World! Here we go. Wing World! Party time! Excellent! <laughs> this is here it comes. We're gonna have the, the side scrolling action platformer. We're gonna leave the living room. We have to get like burritos and and pick up the guitar symbols and records. And I throw records out of my hand. Extreme close up. Whoa! That's not the end. Oh, it is way, way worse than I thought. How do I get out of this? Music off, on, music on. That's fine. Exit? This is serious, what should we do? Let's pay for the mayor's yard. Let's write to our con- Let's go get a pizza! Pizza, pizza, I've got a great idea. Let's have a pizza-thon. Pizza thon, yeah. To have like a, a pizza thon, <laughs> yeah. Why are they just standing here like this? <laughs> this is freaking me out. Uh, Wayne, how do you make a pizza? Oh, you dial up the pizza parlor and you say, "Hey, I'd like a pepperoni pizza. I'm gonna fucking throw up." Alright, um... We'll need our parents' permission. I'd like to watch magicians. This is, this is just random thoughts. We'll need a place to make all this pizza. We'll need some advertising. Are they gonna open up a pizza restaurant? A lot of pizza ingredients. Uh, okay. We'll need a lot- we need a lot more video equipment than we have. We'll need to have a pepperoni farm. We'll need phone volunteers and delivery people. We'll need an electronic totals board. They're just replacing them. We'll have to have a lot of dough. We'll have a really cool music act. That's a good idea, Garth. Ah! ah. How about a, a comedian? I'm stuck forever. Um, I think I might be actually soft locked from the pizza one. Scroll up. No, we're not scrolling up. We already did. We were already here. Remember Mickey's ABCs? Tubin? Reader Rabbit? I kind of just want to play this one. I'm going to streamer's choice this one.
The Learning Company presents Reader Rabbit. Press Enter to go on. It's a lot of info. Press a number to play a game. Sorter, Labeler, Word Train, Matchup Game. Let's do uh, Labeler. Animals, press two. Bug, pig, dog. Okay, I did the label of what they are. That's bug. Bug, pig. Wait, I, I already. They just gave me the answers. Okay, I have to do this in less than 10 seconds. Ready? Start counting... No. Ten. I can't... I, I, I can't believe I'm fucking playing this right now on stream. This is, like, seriously. Van, gas, bus. And start counting. Ready, go. Gas bus again. I'll get it quicker this time. Ready? Start counting. And when the first letter lands, start counting. Out. Oh! Holy shit! I did that fast. I'm okay, I'm done. Have to do this one. <laughs> My ass off, Dawes fucking sucks. This is a very laggy game. European challenge. Kick off three. I think we need to speed this up a little. Language, English, fouls, yes. Offside, injuries, yes. Extra time. Two times three. So five minutes. I don't know. Pitch, game speed is on fast. Referee. Lenient. Fair. Hard. We're going to do lenient. Boy, game speed, f novice, medium. I'm trying to make the CPU cycles faster, but it's not doing anything. Okay, that's looks good, right? Friendly League Cup, friendly league, English, French, challenge. Why can I sit? Why can I change these? Friendly European. I don't know. English. Others. French, German, Italian. Others. What is others? I get. Um. Why is it a Super Nintendo controller? Plug a controller into port one. Uh, well, I don't have, I need an EU controller. I tried. Good idea, Garth! Alright. 
I think I'm scrolling a little bit. The chess master. I'm not playing that. I'm going to veto that. Let's see. Arcade, volleyball. King's Quest 6? Yeah, that's a, that's a really great old game, but... I'm only going to be streaming for like another 40, 50 minutes. So actually, probably going to call it soon here because it's been eight hours. Play Syndicate. Syndicate Plus. You said 10? Well, if I stream for like another 30, 40 minutes, it'll be about eight and a half, nine hours, and then the bits and everything will take us to probably the 10. You said eight hours. It's it's been eight hours. All right. Um, I'll try it, and then we'll, you guys can pick one after. Bits don't take an hour. Uh, well, when I stream for eight to nine hours, they absolutely do, depending on how many come through. This is by Bullfrog. Wow, okay. The people were right when they said two hours of bits and one hour of DOS. <laughs> Bullfrog Productions. Select which one? English. Sound on. I've killed that. Uh, what is this? Is it coordinates? A seven? I don't know what this means. I'm, I'm going to keep it at what the defaults were. Check yes or no, I guess. We'll do the, the standard one. New Hessen Europe. Dateline, NC. New time, 1820. New subjects required for recruitment. Possible subject located. Subject set male. 1.8, wait, 70, it's going too fast. What did I do? I didn't do anything. I skipped the intro. I, di I didn't, though. We'll look at it again. No, no, no. Go. Restart the game. Um, can I not type? I don't get to have a company name or I can't type anything. It'll be auto generated, whatever it is. Well, what? I can't. I, this is, I, I don't know what the, what the fuck. I can't even restart the game. Click the bar. Max, no, is my CPU too fast? I did click the bar like three times. All right, let's see. New England. 5.6 million people.
So this is, I've never played Syndicate before. Is this actually just like Risk? See? Do you see what's happening on the screen? I just want to make sure you see it and hear it. Okay. We can get over that now. So what's the goal? Begin mission. What, what do I have for a mission? Would have liked to have seen the cutscene, right? Intelligence reports have indicated that an army colonel is stealing resources from your weapons division and using them to equip his mercenaries. Use his base? His base has been set up just outside one of our cities and the populace have reported disturbances caused by his troops. Your squad will be deployed near the entrance to the camp. Their objective is to eliminate the colonel. Okay. Enhance. Enhance again. Enhance. Why is enhancing pulling it back? Does an enhance mean go in closer and show me what this is? It zoomed it out. Okay, info. Am I spending money? Surveillance reports show that the camp is guarded by about five militia armed with both shotguns and uh, pistols. All right. Special agent. Equip. Research. Uh, automatic research. Doing great. Okay, um, equip. Is that what you have? You have that on? They all have, like, pistols. Okay, team. Hastings Hill... Disket in Donkin. Okay, I guess that that's those are my four team members. Mods. Legs V1. Sure. Arms. V1. Get it? Heart. Let's get you a new heart in there. Eyes. Enhanced. Okay. Brain. Speeds up brain stem response. Looks good. <laughs> 4600 bucks. Whatever. Okay. Equipped. Well, that's equipped. Good to go. Okay. Let's do it. Scanner. Yeah, get one of those. And get a... What else you got here? Persuadertron? Med kit. Get a few of those. Shotgun. Get one of these too. I got ammo, right? Yeah. Somebody else needs something. You take a shotgun and give, give some uh, armor. This stuff is all too expensive. I have 21. Okay, let's go. Assassinate. Okay. Who's the one that has all the stuff? You? Just go in the front door? What's, like, what's tactical stuff? Can I do the tactical? There's five guards. Alright. Go. Hold on. You, no, 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 no. You go that way.
Shoot! Sh are you gonna shoot him? Shoot him! <laughs> shoot your gun! Why do you have to be so close? Oh my god! Oh, good job! You did it! Okay, <laughs> got it! Uh oh! Oh shit! Good. Pick it up. Alright, two has all the stuff. Who do I need to assassinate? Alright, get in there. Get in there! I know you can get it. Just go on the bridge. You guys can get all get over there. I know you can. Okay, and then in the meantime, send you up here. There were five guards. Do I have like a key card or something? He's in here, I think. Um, what is this map? Where am I? I don't even know what this map is trying to show me, to be honest. Well, what direction is this map facing? Can you go in buildings? So you gotta go up here. Up here and up here. Okay, get over here. The guy with two has all the stuff. You can get in this? Use vehicle? It's a full letter grade. This is a mouse. Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Where's he going? Going. He's driving around the perimeter. <laughs> to come back on the road. Can you shoot out the window? <laughs> shoot him! Alright, get out of the car. Out. How do I get out of car? No, 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 get out of the car. Does the map change? Um, he's in here. Answer the phone. The dude is in here. Oh, you're already right here. Okay. No, it's this one. Why does he have like the sad face? I don't... This thing right here is definitely where I need to go. Go in this house. This blip, but what is this blip even showing me? Like, what? Where do you go? Where is he? Okay. Go in this house. Somebody in here. 